Hey guys, in today's video, we are doing a makeup brush review. So let's get started. I don't know what brand these brushes are, so don't ask. I just got them today. My mom got them for me at Walmart. So they come in this little pouch. They don't come in it, but it's included. So this is the little pouch. It's really cute. It's hard to get the button through. Trust me, my dad still had to do it for me. So let's unbutton it, maybe. And I'll show you the brushes and how well they work with the action. <laughs> maybe. You get this stupid button off. See, like, they made the button hole too small for this. It's so frustrating. There we go. Alright. So it comes with a total of, wait a minute, I just want to see that. Six brushes, and now the results of the brushes. So first up, we'll start up with the which brush is this blush brush. They're really, really soft. Like I think they all have the same exact texture. This one has a little more. These like these ones right here are firm, but just super soft. Like they feel like cotton, not like on build wear. They feel softer than a build wear. So really, really soft. And they all have the same brush looking form except for the heads and everything. Oh, and bristles for this. It's like really, really stiff. Do you call scratch marks on you? Like, watch. They, they could do that to you. So, I recommend this part of the brush. But now that I've showed you these. I'll, t I'll tell you what to do along the way. So I'm going to do the concealer brush, which is this one. Taking my IT concealer. I'll, I'll pick it up with my brush. So I'm going to try to cover up and see how well the platform does with this. So blending, it's perfect with the blend. Yeah, this is perfect with the blending. You just gotta kind of there's a gnat in my room. So yeah, this is perfect with the blending. And we can't even tell it's there. So on the concealing brush, I give it a from one to ten. I give it ten out of ten. It's just a perfect brush. Next up we have the Ingle eyeshadow and I don't use and I don't really use this brush because I don't always show my face for this part. So we'll leave that as a question. Eyeliner. Now, this is the one I'm scared for because like the tips of it is white. But let's see how well this picks up the colors. So, this darker brown. I'm going to place it right here on my let me see hand. So, slight. Yep, it's a perfect little mark. Um, so perfect. It was just kind of wash that off. And I'll wash it off in a minute. Next up, we have the brush brush. I'm going to take my hot pink from my Victoria's Secret. So it kind of picks up the color. So let's see how that does to the swipe test. Yep, it's perfect. It's just like you're rubbing cotton on you. This is the, that's the powder brush for foundation powder. I don't have any. Yeah. <sighs> Then we got this, which you already know that this is your eyebrow brush. And then we have the eye. What's this called? Eye. Eyelash brush. Yeah. So these are all nice brushes. 
and they're really well made for me anyway. Oh, and the today's featured product is NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss. It has perfect pigmentation in it. Let's do a swatch. And it's really, it smells really good. Like strawberry a little bit. This is the color. I just think it's a nice, pretty prominent pink. It's perfect if you want a shade of pink to your lips. But as it came with the kit, you would, I right, if you're trying to do a scale a little bit looking fuller, do the pumper with it. I got this on a kit, this kit was my kit for Christmas. Yep, that's last year's Christmas, but yeah. Anyway, um, I always like the brushes. I'll have to wash this off in a sec. I'm gonna go on my bracelet. And so, all these brushes I recommend are 8 out of 10. Um, I still think you see the brush, that thing's perfect. But yeah. But I like the little review I did. And um, link me, link me something that you want to do next, and I will do it. I have a haul coming up for you guys, so yeah. Um, bye.